Hi, I'm Erin. I am happily married to my husband, Wes, of 11 years, and we have three small children, three girls. But that doesn't mean that we don't fight, okay? I mean, it happens to all couples. And in fact, it just happened the other day. And today I want to give you some tips on how you can make that uh, better or more effective when fighting does happen. Really what it came down to is all of a sudden I got emotional and I got choked up about something that I didn't expect to. And my husband stopped and he took time out of what he was doing and he said, what's wrong? Okay, and that was the first thing that was great is that he stopped and he acknowledged the fact that I was upset and he asked what was wrong. And he shared that, hey, look, this is a safe space. You can share whatever it is you need to and we'll talk about it. And I think that was good because at first, you know, maybe the way I was feeling, I didn't feel justified in the way I was feeling or I felt silly in the way that I was feeling, but still, nonetheless, I was feeling that way. And the fact that he was able to say, let's talk about this, um, share with me, let's figure it out, was huge for me. And I think that's one thing I encourage. You know, every marriage, no matter how great it is, can have difficulties. You're going to have disagreements. And a lot of the times it comes down to whatever your spouse said, you interpreted it differently than how he meant that or she meant that. So I really recommend, like one thing that has helped us a lot is communication. You know, so when you're having an argument with your spouse or having a disagreement, the first thing I recommend is that you tell each other, look, this is a safe space. You can share with me, we can talk about this, and let's work through this. The other thing is don't dismiss how they feel or tell them how they feel is wrong, okay? Because I think sometimes we get caught up in emotions. We don't even know ourselves if what we're feeling is right or okay. So I think it's good to acknowledge your spouse. I can understand how you feel that way, but this is really what I meant by that. And I, I didn't mean for you to interpret it the way that you did. Okay, so however that is, but just make sure that you make it a safe space. Make sure that you understand your spouse. Don't tell them that their feelings are right or wrong. Let them express their feelings. Um, and then you can share as well in those same manners. But make sure that once you guys are talking about it, make sure that once it's resolved, that you resolve it. I would suggest you guys pray together and then don't bring it up again. That's one thing. You don't continue to bring up things that you've talked about. So I hope that helped and uh, you guys have a great weekend. Talk to you later. Bye.